Okay, so I don't have any makeup on right now. Excuse the bed mess back there. Um, but I wanted to do this video without any makeup on. To be real. So I do have like an acne. Uh, is it right there? Is it right here? This is not a zit. These are not zits. They're like dark spots on my skin. Um, but this is and this was. Um, I do have really red cheeks in here. Um, and I don't have any makeup on right now. And I have really dark circles under my eyes and stuff um but I think this is actually working to clear up bits of my skin like this um is it never actually man manifested and I do think that this is working um from what I showed you already in the uh, there you go <laughs> I think it's working but I think this is really harsh and I don't think it's for everyone um I'm gonna read off what it says here so it says um Pacifica Coconut Milk Cream to Foam Face Wash, and as you saw in, in the demonstration, it really does come out cream, and it really does suds up really easily and becomes foam. Um, it says it's supposed to remove makeup, cleanse, and de-stress, and it's got coconut, vanilla, and bubbles. I'm not making this up. It really says it right there. <laughs> Um, this is for all skin types, especially stressed, and it's sulfate-free, it's 100% vegan, and cruelty-free. You get 5 ounces. It says, superfood for your skin. This creamy milk gets perfectly bubbly to help lift dirt and debris to the surface. This is a go-to in your skin's age-fighting arsenal. Plus, it smells amazing with the aroma power of vanilla. I don't like the smell of it at all. I think it smells terrible. I try to keep it away from my nostrils and, like, the bottom of my nose area because I don't want to smell it. I really don't like the smell. Um, um, I'll leave a link to it so you can look up the ingredients list and see if there's anything that bothers you in it. Um... So, the most I can say about it is, it is that I don't like the smell. I don't think it smells like coconuts. I don't think it smells like vanilla. I think it kind of stinks. And it's really harsh. Um, it gets your skin feeling that squeaky clean feeling. And I don't necessarily like that feeling. Um, but if you have super oily skin, you will love this. Because it will make your skin feel like it's super clean. But you need to moisturize afterwards because you can't just let your skin get super dry and get that squeaky clean feeling without putting moisture back in. Otherwise, your skin's just going to create more and keep creating more. Believe me, I know. I used to never moisturize because I was convinced that moisturizing and putting oils on my face or putting cream moisturizers on my face was just going to make it worse and more oily. But it actually really helps combat it. So if you have dry skin, do not use this. Do not use this at all. It's going to make you feel so squeaky that you're going to want to, like, rip the skin off of your face. Um, other than that, that's really all I can say about it. I still want to try the coke or the cactus one after this and see if it's any better. Um, am I going to repurchase this? Probably not. Do I think it's doing my skin some benefits? Yeah, I do. Um, but it's not my favorite ever. It's not the worst ever. So, if you guys have any reviews on the cactus one, um, please leave me a link to it and I will watch it. Um, and yeah, that is my full review. So, thanks for watching. Bye!